so good evening all hi everyone welcome to yet another live from think institute of design so before we continue uh, host am i clearly audible yes sir you are audible sir thank you so uh, hi everyone good evening so welcome to yet another yet another live from think institute of design so this particular live is regarding the latest notification from the council of architecture regarding the revised eligibility for the admission to br course so without any delay let's look upon it so recently the council of architecture has officially published a notification regarding the minimum standards of architectural education so as per the notification they have been clearly mentioning what are the kind of minimum standards required for the architectural education so what will be the uh, eligibility criteria in order to get in not to get into an architecture course or br course in india so uh, we know the nata examination is going on and the official notification regarding the nata examination has been already published the prospectus has been already published so in this year's nata official brochure they have mentioned about the previous eligibility condition as uh, in order to get into admission in br courses a candidate uh, should need 50% aggregate in physics chemistry and mathematics and also they need 50% aggregate in total in plus 2 and as well as in diploma also they require a 50% aggregate uh, with mathematics as a compulsory subject so initially in the brochure which has been last published by the nata uh, in the prospectus in the official brochure of nata they have mentions an eligibility like that but but as per the latest notification which has been published on 30th june they have made an amendment in the criteria so uh, the latest notification which has been published is what you are seeing right now so as per the official notification what they are mentioning is that no candidate shall be admitted to architecture course unless she or he has passed an examination at the end of 10 plus 2 scheme of examination with physics chemistry and mathematics subjects or passed 10 plus 3 diploma examination with mathematics as compulsory subject so so when you when we look into that they have clearly removed the 50 percentage criteria from the eligibility criteria so they have removed it and you just only need to pass the 10 plus 10 plus 2 examination with pcm the physics chemistry mathematics uh, subject and also if you are a diploma 10 plus 3 diploma student then you just need to study mathematics as a compulsory subject and you, you just have to pass the 50 percentage criteria has been removed from the eligibility condition and also another important thing is the another important point which has been added is the the candidate needs to qualify an aptitude test in architecture conducted either by nta the national testing agency that is the je examination especially the je paper 2 examination exclusively for the architecture and also uh, or nata examination conducted by the council of architecture and you uh, so in general they have mentioned that uh, in order to get into admission not to get into admission in architecture definitely the candidate needs to qualify an aptitude test in architecture conducted by the nta the national testing agency which is a je examination so that can be uh, the je paper 2 examination the iit examination the architecture aptitude test for uh, iit examination as well as the uh, examination the nata examination conducted by the council of architecture so the student needs to qualify any of these examination in order to get admitted into architecture courses so these are the important regulation which has been uh, or amendment which has been made in the eligibility criteria and another important the major important point which has been underlined in the red line so you can uh, read that which is a major one of the important point that is this particular uh, amendment or change shall be applicable for the academic session 2022 23 only as a one time measure and thereafter the original regulations regulations as notified in the gazette on 11 8 2020 shall be enforced so this particular regulation will be only applicable for this current academic 
session only so for the next year definitely we just have to wait the criteria from the council of architecture so this particular uh, change uh, or the regulation is only applicable for the academic session 2022 23 so this is the one of the major important updation regarding the eligibility criteria in order to get into br courses so one is uh they have removed the 50 percent criteria you need to only pass the 10 plus 2 examination with physics chemistry and mathematics as compulsory subject or if you are a student who are doing the diploma course definitely you just have to study and pass uh study mathematics as a compulsory subject and you, you just need to pass the examination that is the criteria and another important thing the candidates need to qualify an aptitude test in architecture conducted either by nta the national testing agency the je examination or not conducted by council of architecture so this is one of the major updations so guys uh, we know the upcoming uh, nata examination is also coming up you will be on uh, in its study also so uh, for more updations like this so do subscribe think in store designs youtube channel so uh, that's from our side for this particular live so if you are having any kind of queries please do Uh, comment on the chat box so thank you everyone thank you so much